Hey y'all, so I wanted to come in really quick to show you guys how I get ready for a clinic day. So I just got out the shower and I had on I have on this tank top t-shirt because my port has to be accessed. Just got out the shower, so I am going to moisturize with just straight up Vaseline. No scents, no perfumes, none of that. So, my hands are, they get really dry really fast now, since I had chemo, so I have to get those really good. But yes, on clinic morning, I actually shower with the antibacterial soap that was given. Should I show y'all? So this is the soap that I shower with. It's an antibacterial soap. It's very mild. And I do use a washcloth. I see some people saying don't use a washcloth over where your port is. Or if you're going through chemo or radiation. I use a washcloth, but I use it very lightly. I don't try to scrub really hard. So, yeah. That's just me. I guess that's to each his own. So, this is what I do when I'm getting ready for clinic. I have a bag of meds that I have to take for my morning meds. I already took my thyroid pill as soon as I got up. I try to separate when I take my thyroid medicine and when I take the rest of my medication. So, my numbing cream. I put a little bit of numbing cream on a Q-tip. Ooh, too much. It doesn't take a lot. And I have this pressing seal. I've already cut off a piece and I have it laying upside down on my little station, my little area. And I put a little cream right where I know there's going to be access in my port. I use a Q-tip. Everybody don't use a Q-tip. You don't have to. It's just something I choose to do. So, press and seal. I just cut like a little small piece. So by the time we get there, it should have done what it's supposed to do. Today's earring of choice will be my little cherries. <laughs> okay, so I'm back with my little cherries on. I get so hot after taking a shower that I start sweating really bad. I don't know why because that's something new for me. But I stay hydrated. And like I said, I do have to take my morning medication, so I'll be drinking more water for that. When I get to the infusion room, <clears throat> I may be taking off my long sleeve and just leaving my tank top on because it, it can get hot, it can get really cold, you just never know. So I like to dress comfortably. <laughs> Comfortable. So... That looked like it's sealed up pretty good. And I'm going to put on my shirt. I try to eat something green in the morning. Or some fruit. Something like spinach is really good in the morning. Even if it's just like maybe... I want to say three spoonfuls of spinach. I just like to eat something green in the morning or have some fruit. On the days when I can. You can't all the time because sometimes we're rushing. But I'm not rushing this morning, so. But my cherries. Now, let's see a close-up. 
But anyway, that's pretty much it. I always have my water close by. When I get out of the shower, I moisturize with just regular Vaseline. I make sure I have my medicine close by. My pressing seal. I actually prepare this before I get into the shower. What I do is I just... I'll show you guys real quick. I just cut a little slit like this. Cut a little slit like that. This way, that way it's easier to tear off. And then I lay it upside down on my little station right here. So that way when I get out of the shower and I'm ready to put on my cream, moisturizing all that, it's already here. It's already ready to go. I don't have to struggle with it, fight with it. I have my Q-tips. <clears throat> have my Q-tips already here, ready to go. I have my <clears throat> motivational cards here. So, try to speak life into myself every day. And I also have a, a sign that's right, in, like right when you get ready to walk out of my bedroom door. And I say that I read this sign before I leave out of my door in the morning. It says, trust in the Lord with all thine heart and lean not into that. Let me just show you. <laughs> so, yeah. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart lean not into thine own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him. <sighs> and he shall direct thy path. So, I say that before I leave out the door. And I just hope that I got everything I always try to make sure I have my charger if I don't have nothing else make sure I have my charger on my phone because when you sit in the infusion room you may get bored you may want to scroll a little you may want to play some games on your phone whatever and another thing that's good to have look this to turn into I need to do another video on what I take with me puzzle books are really good to have Yep, so that's it, y'all. That's how I get ready to go to clinic in the morning. I make sure I shower really good, put on my deodorant, moisturize, and I make sure I put some numbing cream on my port, take my medication, and drink some water. But that's it. I'll be doing another video of what I pack in my chemo bag. Until next time, gracias por ver. Thanks for watching. Bye.